YouTube. What's up, y'all? My name is Joan. Coming back at y'all with another video, and today I'm gonna be doing the highly requested shake method to get my curls. A lot of you guys who watch my first two videos know that I used to do the shake method when my hair was like a lot shorter. Shake your hair, just shake it left and right, um, back and forth. I'm about to do the shake method. But once my hair started getting longer, I strayed away from it and started experimenting and falling in love with other techniques like twist outs. Shingling. Oh, y'all know I love me some shingling, bro. Stop playing with me. And finger coils. But let's keep it a buck. Like, a lot of you guys are lazy and just don't want to go through the motions. And I get that, okay? I understand. Those methods do take more time and effort compared to the shake method, which is really just a fast and easy way to get pretty decent curls. And now, since my hair has gotten much longer, a lot of you guys been hitting your boy up and want to see how the shake method looks with my hair at this length. And you know I got to do what the people want to see. So today, I'm going back to my roots. We're doing the shake method. And I think it will be pretty cool just to use the same products that I used in one of my older videos just so y'all could easily compare the two but since my hair is longer and since I'm more <sighs> experienced in the curly hair game you know what I'm saying the techniques that I use are going to be a little different so stay tuned for that but hold up cut the music like let's get serious real quick y'all know how this works I drop content that y'all want to see and in return y'all pay a brother by leaving a like on this video. Come on now, what y'all thought I was gonna say? Bruh, chill, I don't want your money. Like, if you trying to give me a couple dollars, you know, I ain't gonna refuse, you feel me? But I really want that like, so go ahead and hit that button, you know, just help a brother out. But anyways, enough talking, let's go ahead and get started with this video, let's get it. All right, so I washed, detangled, and deep conditioned my hair a few days ago. But here's the thing, I didn't put any products in my hair, mainly because, <laughs> laziness you know a brother was lazy so i'm just gonna do a quick little cold wash because my hair was hurt like it ain't have no type of moisture for those of you who don't know cold wash is short for conditioner wash since i already shampooed my hair this week i'm using a cold wash because it's a lit way to cleanse your hair without the harsh effects of using the shampoo i'm using the as i am coconut cold wash and this is actually my first time using this product and to be honest with y'all i'm hooked okay like i really mess with this product this slip is a one it cleanses your scalp and it smells like bubble gum, bro. Like, pop bubble gum while she thumb through a wig. What? Pop bubble gum. I'm not a rapper. And I'm not a sponsor either, but I'm gonna put the link below if you wanna check it out. Moving on, I am now detangling my hair, which is one of the most important steps. Like, I cannot stress to y'all how important this is. My hair was already detangled in my twist. This process was pretty easy for your boy, you know? I don't mean to toot my own horn, but, you know, hey, it is what it is. But you're gonna really wanna take your time when detangling your hair just to reduce breakage and make the rest of the steps as quick and easy as possible. I made a step-by-step -step guide on how to easily detangle your hair. The link will be above. When I'm finished, I rinse out the product, hop out the shower, and get ready for the styling process. The products we're gonna be using today is first the Shea Moisture Curl and Shine Conditioner, the Silicone Free Miracle Styler Leave-In Treatment, the Curl Enhancing Smoothie, and the Wetline Extreme Gel. I start by splitting my hair in four sections, and I take the first section and spray with water now look with this method you're gonna want to make sure your hair is extremely wet throughout this entire process there's literally no such thing as using too much water so I'm gonna need y'all to go crazy I right? since I have low porosity hair I'm gonna be doing the LOC method to moisturize my hair I'm gonna start by applying the curling shine conditioner I'll be using this as my leave-in for those of you who don't know this is legit one of my favorite conditioners it is super thick and has a lot of slip which is necessary for my thick hair next I'm gonna be using the silicone free miracle styler leave-in treatment i'm just really using this for extra moisture it has a lighter consistency than the curl and shine conditioner and it just makes your hair feel amazing my dude next i'm going to use the curl enhancing smoothie as my first styling product this is my og right here this is my shooter like we've been through war together on phone now you don't need a lot of this this is a really thick and moisturizing cream that also helps define your curls as y'all can see i'm really focusing on moisturizing my hair so my hair could be juicy and moisturized throughout the entire week because having my hair just lasts one to two days like we ain't doing none of that next i'm going to lock in the moisture by using jamaican black castor oil which is literally one of the most potent oils for locking in hair hydration this is a thick and heavy oil so a little bit goes a long way bro trust me lastly to really define them curls and give it that shape we all lust after i'm going to use the wet line extreme gel this is a really stronghold gel and works perfect for thicker hair textures also Working smaller section 
options if you want more defined curls. Now I know I ain't used the Wetline Extreme Gel in the first tutorial. To be honest, I ain't even use a gel at all. Like I accidentally used another conditioner, but we ain't gonna talk about all that. What I do for my hair might not work for your hair. If you don't know what the LOC method is, how to moisturize your hair or your hair porosity, you obviously ain't watched my last video. Bro, what is you? All right, look, it's titled everything you need to know about curly hair. That video is super important because everybody's hair is different. So make sure you watch that video after this one. The link will be above. I'm just going to continue the same steps throughout my hair and I'll be back when I'm finished. All right, when I'm done, it is time. It is time to go rock star status. I'm just going to shake my head in all types of directions. Now, to be completely honest with you, I don't even know what this do, but all I know is that doing this activates your curls. And to be real with you, that's all a brother needs to know. Forget about the science and everything. Like if it works, it works. At this point, you could be a weirdo and air dry if you want, which is going to take you hours upon hours upon hours. Like I cannot stress to you how long this is going to take, especially since we used a lot of water and a lot of products. So it's up to you, bro. Do what you please. But for me, I ain't got time for all that. I like diffusing my hair with my Dyson blow dryer, which is way faster and minimizes frizz. Like it's a win-win situation. This is how my hair looks after diffusing. My hair is very moisturized and defined. And this is what it looks like after my hair is stretched out. <sighs> I'm speechless right now. We gotta talk. We just, we just have to talk. All right, y'all, look, listen. I ain't do the shake method in forever. It's been like over a year, okay? And I know in the beginning of this video, I was talking all this smack saying that with this method, you're not gonna get that much definition. I was wrong. I was completely wrong, bro. This, do you not see? Oh my God, y'all don't understand, bro. I'm speechless. I am literally speechless right now, bro. Like this literally did not take long at all. And yeah, it's not as defined as like the shingle method or like the finger coils. But with the shake method, it took the time that it would have took me with those other methods and it cut it in half, literally. And that's the thing, like I ain't do this method in so long that I forgot how easy it was. Oh yeah, and shout out to Shea Moisture for these products. Every time I use this combination of products, my results turn out fire every time it never failed if you guys want to check out these products the links will be in the description box below but yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you made it to the end make sure you leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys later peace